Welcome back, my friends. We want to introduce you to a wonderful young lady and a brilliant author, Karen Shrek, joining us this morning with her book called Bum 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 While He Was Away. Mm -hmm. This is a, a great book because it has a lot of connections to our great state. Tell us about uh, the inspiration behind this book. Sure. Um, well, I grew up coming to Oklahoma with my mother who was raised here. Both sets of my great-grandparents came to Oklahoma during the run. My grandfather, um, his first home was the claim that they staked, and my grandmother was born here soon afterwards, and I've always loved Oklahoma, so I wanted to set a novel here. Um, it's a story for today, a love story for today, but it's based on the love story that my mother um, experienced when she grew up here. She married a childhood sweetheart from Oklahoma. I think we've got some pictures here. This is. Mm -hmm. uh Yep. These are old family portraits. That's right. That's my mom and her first husband. Um, sh they married when they were 18, 19. I think this is a picture oh, that he took of her. That's that, a great picture. Yeah, I thought about a lot when I was writing the book. Um, he went off to serve in World War II and died um, heroically in battle in World War II. And um, I've always wondered about their story. Um, this is the two of them again, I think on their honeymoon. So cool. Um, and this is her, I believe, in the apartment they lived in while he was in basic training. In 1944. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, That's right. just give us, just give us a, a Cliff's Notes version of the book. Sure. Um, it's about a young woman, 18 years old, named Penna, who comes to Oklahoma with her mother. Um, they've been living there for about a year. She falls deeply in love with a young man, David, who's 19 and is being deployed to Iraq. So. Um, after he leaves, she searches out a grandmother that she's been estranged from um, when she learns that the grandmother's first husband died in World War II because she's missing, you know, longing, struggling with her longing for this boy that she loves. And she wants to find someone who's gone through a similar experience. So, um, in a sense, it's a story about romantic love, but it's also about the love that um, people feel across generations. It's really a universal story. Mm. And I know you're in Chicago now, but uh, we appreciate you coming back to Oklahoma to share your book. And if you'd like to meet Karen, she's got uh, a couple of book signings coming mm -hmm. up this weekend. That's right. The first is tonight at Best of Books in Edmond, and then tomorrow afternoon at Full Circle Books, about 3 o'clock right here in the city. That's right. Thank, thank you, you so much for being here. Uh, I have a copy on my desk. I can't wait to get to oh, it. Thank you. Uh,